गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू ए पी आर एस ऑनलाइन क्लासेस students this is v nagmani apr school achkapuram in this class today we discuss about estimation and rounding off this topic is last topic in our the first chapter numbers all around us we now discuss about estimation and rounding off estimation and rounding Ah. What is estimation? What is estimation? Now we learn what is estimation. For this, I give small example. If it is your birthday, your mom asks you to bring how many chocolates to uh, for your classmates. Then how do you estimate your classmates number or your school and your friends number then uh, in 6th class your friends 50 members in 7th uh, class your friends 20 members 8th uh, class both 10 members total 9th uh, class 7 members 10th class 2 members total Uh, nine, eight, eighty-nine. But you tell to your mom around hundred or ninety because that is not exact number, but that is nearest to this number. This is estimation. That is not exact number. That is round off to some. tens or hundreds or thousands estimation means estimation means not exact calculation not exact calculation a rough a rough figure of number or some value estimation means a rough calculation of value number or quantity a rough calculation of value number or quantity now we learn about rounding off we learn about rounding off rounding off to tens we first learn rounding off to tens This is fifty, ten, twenty, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty. Look at this number line. After twelve, fifteen, seventy. Take this twelve. Now we round off to tens. Twelve round off to tens. Here we observe twelve is nearest to tens or twenty nearest to ten nearest to ten. Twelve is round off to ten. Boy, after seventy, seventy is nearest to twenty. Seventy is nearest to twenty. So seventy is round off to twenty. Now after fifty, fifty is nearest to ten or nearest to twenty. Mid value. This is mid value between ten and twenty. In this case, we round off to twenty maximum value, highest value. So fifteen is round off to round off to twenty. 
round of to one. Fifty means round of to twenty. What is this rounding of to tens? We take any number. We take any number. We choose this is nearest to before numbers or after numbers. And before tens or after tens, then we choose nearest. We choose nearest rounding number. So we take another example. Round up to tens. Now take sixty, sixty-five, seventy. Place value of sixty-three is sixty-three. Number line sixty-three. Sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, then sixty-five. So we clearly, we clearly say that sixty-three is closest to sixty. So sixty three is round up to its tens is sixty. Sixty three is round up to sixty. In this way we take sixty eight. Then sixty six, sixty seven, sixty eight, sixty nine. Here sixty eight is nearest to seventy. So sixty eight is round off to nearest to tens means seventy. So in this case we learn how to we round off to tens sixty three sixty eight. Here we take ones place. Ones place is three. Three is less than five. Three is less than five. In this case, we round up to sixty. We round up to sixty. Ones place is ones place becomes zero, and tens place remaining same. Remaining same. In this case. One's place is greater than five. Greater than five. Then tenth place is plus one. Seven. One's place remains zero. Seventy. We round off to seven. In this way, I give some more examples. Seventy six. Seventy six. Now seventy six. We round up to tens. It means ones place. Ones place. See ones place. Ones place is greater than five. Ones place is greater than five. Then ones place becomes zero. And seventh place, seven tens place plus one eight. Eighty. Seventy six is nearest to eighty. So we round up seventy six nearest tens is. Eighty. And the example forty two. Forty two. See ones place. Ones place is less than five. Ones place is less than five. Then we take ones place zero and also tens place same. So forty two is nearest to five. So we take three digit number. We take. Three digit number eight eight thirty seven. This is three digit number ones tens hundreds. But we take eight thirty seven round off to nearest tens nearest tens. So we take ones place. Ones place is greater than five. So we take this is zero. And plus one to tens place. This is greater than five. So then we take plus one to tens place. We round up to tens. So we add one to tens place. So this is forty. This is same. So eight forty. Eight thirty seven is nearest round up to tens is eight forty. We 
know that a thirty a party then a thirty party. This is a thirty seven. A thirty seven is nearest to a a party. So a thirty seven is round off to a party. Next, we take four digit number. We take four digit number. Four hundred four thousand six hundred ninety three. Then we round off to tens, nearest tens. Then we look at three. Three is less than five. Three is less than five. Then we take zeros in one place and same tens place and same tens place because three is less than five. So six is same, four is same. So we round off to nearest tens. Four thousand six hundred ninety-three is round off to four thousand six hundred ninety. So another example: seven thousand six hundred ninety-seven. Ninety-seven. Look at this one place. Seven is greater than five. Then add plus one to tens place. So this became ten. This zero, ten, one, seven, seven, seven hundred, seven hundred, seven thousand, seven hundred. So we observe seven thousand six hundred ninety. Seven thousand seven hundred. Here seven thousand six hundred ninety-five. This is seven thousand six hundred ninety-seven. This nearest to seven thousand seven hundred. Next, we learn about mitras. One example. Uh, Eight hundred six. Eight hundred sixty-five. Eight hundred sixty-five. Five is equal to five. Five is equal to five. So five is equal to five. Then ten place add to one. So this is seven. This is zero. This is same number. Eight seventy. Eight hundred sixty-five is nearest tens is eight hundred seventy. So. These examples are round off to tens. Now we learn about round off to hundreds. Round off to hundreds. Now we take seven hundred sixty-four. Round off to hundreds, not tens. Seven hundred. Seven hundred sixty. Now we learn round off to hundreds. To take one example, seven hundred sixty-eight. Seven hundred sixty-eight is round off to nearest hundreds. Nearest hundreds. That means in number line, seven hundred, eight hundred. In tens, in tens we take hundreds. Tens. Ten, twenty, fifty. In this way, in hundreds, seven hundred, eight hundred, seven hundred fifty. Seven hundred fifty is the mid gap. Seven hundred sixty is the seven hundred sixty-eight. So this number is nearest to eight hundred. This number is nearest to eight hundred. So we. Round off to hundred. Seven hundred sixty-eight is round off to round off to eight hundred. We take seven hundred twenty-three. Seven hundred twenty-three. Then seven hundred twenty-three is nearest to nearest to seven hundred. Seven hundred twenty-three is round off to seven hundred. Here we. Know that round off to tens, we take six six tens place. Tens place is less than or greater than five. Greater than five. Tens place.
place is greater than 5. Then we add 1 to 100 place. Then we add 1 to 100 place. Remaining for zeros. Remaining for zeros. 7 plus 1, 8. So we round off to 768 to nearest 800. Nearest 800. This is round off to 100. So we take plus 1 to 100 place. Where tens place is greater than 5. Tens place is less than, less than 5. Then we take tens place and one place is zeros and hundred place also same. So seven hundred twenty three is round off to seven hundred. Now we take four digit number. Four digit number. Eight thousand four hundred twenty three. Now we round off this number to hundreds. Take tens place, round off to hundreds, then we take tens place and after 2 is less than 5. 2 is less than 5. Then take zeros, ones place and tens place zeros and fourth uh, and hundred place is same, thousands place is same. 
zero, 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 zero. Plus one. Add. Add plus one to thousands place. This is four thousand. Minus two, four thousand. You understand? One more example. Five thousand. Children, small activity chedda mikad manam. Ikada miko ka car kan pisundi. A car miro up chase the adi 424 dati 425 kelle sir ki adi mo tundi mali down aayi 430 kosundi. Adi videnga manam tens rounds chase se ta puru 421, 422, 423, 424 unte. Akkad nunchi adi 420 down out undi. Ante manam 420 round out chastam 10 slow. Adi 425 ke lesser ki 425, 426, 427, 428, 429 I te. Akkad down out undi 430 ki down out undi. Miru 10 crown chedan ki dini e activity ni chakaga adun ches kunte meku telistundi. Tens ki round of chedan ki first manam ichin number lo right side and tens place ki right side unna ones place ni chudal first ones place in manam a digit undi and the abjuru cheali abjuru che set up man ki a ones place lo one two three four unayan kundi unte went in a manain cheali ones place in zero chase si tens place in the same pieces quality you could 63 on the kata hadi three ones place loan the three less than five kadama cover t three becomes zero and six same cover t six stick man or round of chest them are they look well are 68 allow nine condi and a round of the up chest them five six seven eight nine on nine condi a prim chest them man oh 3 ni same 0 chesi 6 ni up chestam ante 7 chestam 70 ki round off chestam anamata okay ade mana 100s ki round off cheyalanu anukondamma 100s round off cheyalante appudu manam 100s ki pakkana tens place ni chudali tens place lo em untundi ok number 6 683 teeskunnam anukondi 8 tens place lo undi 8 tens place lo unte 8 greater than 5 so we uh, round off to 6 plus 1 700 700 remaining tens place and ones plus zeros kabati manu 700 ki round off chasta man mata okay are they thousands place on kundi manum thousands right side loan na hundred space in choose kuni a place hu, 5 ki below on the upper on the choose kuni dan bati manum what me uh, thousands place in up chair ma down chair ma choose kunti easy ga telistundi dear students take screenshot and practice these examples and complete this worksheet also
Now we learn four fundamental operations: addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, or uh, estimation. So first example for addition. And eight thousand one hundred sixty-two and five thousand seven hundred eighty-nine. Estimate the result. Estimate the result means first we estimate these two numbers and then we add. First, eight thousand one hundred sixty-two is four-digit number. This round we round off this number to thousands. So eight. Hundred places less than five. So one sentence and hundred places zero and eight is same. So eight thousand. We round up these number to eight thousand. Five thousand seven hundred eighty nine. Seven is greater than five. So we add plus one to five. Then remaining for zeros. So we round off this number to six thousand. So we add these two numbers because estimate estimate the addition estimate the addition. So zero 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 eight plus six fourteen fourteen thousand. This is fourteen thousand. This is estimation. 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 Addition. Now we calculate exact value because why we take this is rounding off to eight thousand. This is rounding off to six thousand. Total is fourteen thousand. We verify. We verify the. Exact number with estimation values. Exact values. Add these two numbers: nine to eleven, one fourteen, one fifteen, one one two nine, and this is thirteen. Thirteen thousand nine hundred fifty one. Thirteen thousand nine hundred fifty one is nearest to fourteen thousand. This is nearest. Next we take two thousand eight hundred sixty seven. Here also a hundred place is greater than five. So plus one two thousand place remaining for zero. So then we subtract zero 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 three thousand. This is estimation value of difference of these two numbers. Now we verify. Students, given one example, five lakhs thirty six thousand seven hundred twenty four, round off to nearest tens, hundred and thousand. Follow these examples also. Then we add, subtract the. Numbers.
Now we learn multiplication. Estimate the product by rounding and verify the result of 58 and 67. Now we take 58 and 67. We round off this number to nearest tens. Nearest tens is 8 is greater than 5. So plus 1 to 10 digits. So 6 remains 0. And 7 is greater than 5. So plus 1 tens place. So 7. This is G. So we round off 58 to 60, 67 to 7. So this is the easy method to multiply the number. 0, 0. 6, 7, 42. 4,200. Now we round off this number to nearest thousands. 4,000. This is the estimation number. Now we calculate actual the multiplication. 58 and 67. 7 major 56, 5, 35, 5, 40, 6 major 48, 4, 6 major 30, 34, 6, 8, 8, 3, 3,886 is nearest to 4,000. Our multiplication, estimation multiplication is nearest to our actual multiplication. Now we see division. Division 976. 976 is 3-digit number. We round off this number to 100. So we take 7. 7 is greater than 5. So we add plus 1 to 100. So 0, 0 and 10. Thousand. So 976 is round off to thousands. And 18 is nearest to 20. R8 is greater than 5. So plus 1 to G. So 0. Thousand is divisible by 20. That is 0. 5, 0, 50. Okay. Next, we verify actual division. 18. 18, 5, 0. 18, 5, 0, 90. 7, 6. 18, 4, 0. 72. 4, 4 is reminder. We have 54. 54 is round off to 50. So, our estimation is right. So, now we will learn round off to tens, round off to hundreds, round off to thousands. And applications are addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. So, next we take worksheet also. Thank you to all. In today's class, we discuss round of to tens, hundreds, thousands and we apply these two addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. Take screenshots these worksheets and practice them. Students, this is the complete notes to this topic. Please note down and practice well. Thank you to all.